My name is Jamie Sellers, I'm a songwriter and producer from Scotland. I'm now based at my own uh, studio complex up in North Essex called Run Wild Music. Songwriting is essentially improvisation and I think I think people do struggle with that. There, there are people who find it very easy from the word go and there are other people, and particularly you find I think with people who come from a more structured, maybe classically trained or, or, or that kind of background where it is very you play this, you play this, you know, when you actually just ask them just to sit down and make it up. Some people find that quite daunting. You know, I quite often say to, to artists that I work with, the point where I became a better songwriter was when I sort of stopped trying. So I think sometimes people put too much pressure on themselves and, and overthink it. And they, you know, the, the first thing any, any kind of inexperienced songwriter will say to me is, oh, I've written this, but it's terrible. You know, and of course it isn't terrible, but it's just that lack of confidence in, in what they're doing. So I think, you know, the, the advice that I often give to people is just stop trying, just stop thinking about it, just write it. I'm aware that's often easier said than done, but I think um, b because, you know, songwriting is not an exact science, it's not like lots of other areas of music, um, it is very much about what comes out and it is very much about improvising and just about um, kind of just doing it and not overthinking it and that's very much what I try to get across to the, the students that come to these workshops is yes we're going to spend some time talking about the, the general building blocks of songs and how songs are put together but just keep those in the back of your mind don't make those the focus don't think that it's you're trying to like put Lego bricks together because that's not how it works. Keep those in the back of your mind and just be aware of them but don't let it dictate what you're doing. Just do it, don't think too much about it and just use those to help kind of keep you in line, you know. Uh, for anybody that, that wants to, to give songwriting a go that hasn't up until now and is maybe worried about it, I would tell them to not worry about it. If you want to get into songwriting and you find sitting down on your own to write a song impossible, then don't, don't do that. Find other people that are musicians or go and collaborate with people. I think collaboration is, is so important and that's kind of the cornerstone of, of this whole workshop that I've been doing today, is about collaboration and about, I think people put too much pressure on themselves thinking that, right, I've got to now sit in my room and write the chords and the melody and the lyrics and everything. And that's, to, to honest, that's not really how songs are written most of the time. The, most of the songs I work on is two, three, four people. Um, and that's kind of how most songs are written. Um, if you're able to sit and write on your own, then great, do that as well. But I would really encourage people to get out and collaborate with other people because not only does it take a bit of pressure off you because you've got someone else to bounce ideas off, but you'll end up coming up with things that you wouldn't ordinarily come up with by yourself. Not only that, but you'll start to build a network of other musicians, other artists, other writers, other people, you know, that that you'll then build a network, which, you know, as musicians, that that's the key. You know, you've got to have a network of, of people that you know, that you work with. So I would say, yeah, from a songwriting perspective, definitely go and write songs with other people. Don't just sit there and stew on your own and think, I can't do this. Go and sit in a room with a couple of other people and, and have a go at writing, because you might find that makes it easier. Anyone that really wants to pursue music as a career, I would say, if it's anything less than an obsession, then it might not be enough. You know, I think you've really got to be pretty obsessed with it to really, really make it work.